What's going on guys, it's your boy DPJ here today with another Destiny video and today I bring you Challenge of the Elders Loot Results across all three of my characters. So let's just get straight into the loot I obtained and let's start with my Hunter. Okay, so for the 30k challenge I received the Queen's Choice Sidearm. Dropping offering 333 attack with solar burn. Mods were causing damage with this weapon increases its stability and readying this weapon grants a brief period of bonus accuracy. Now to be honest, I ain't really into sidearms at all. I still have it, but I am considering infusing it. So what do you guys think? Shall I infuse it or shall I keep it? Let me know down below. From the 90k package, I received the Warden's Rally Gauntlets. These dropped a 334 defense, offering intellect and discipline. Mods were increases melee attack speed and increases reload speed of scout rifles. Moving on to my Warlock, and from the 30k challenge, I received the Her Memory Queen's Auto Rifle, dropping at a 330 attack. Mods were melee kills while this weapon is equipped, have a chance to refill the magazine, and this weapon becomes more accurate as your health gets lower. To be honest, I think the one I already owned has a better role, so this one will be used for infusion. Moving on to the 90k package, and I received the Cow's Bond class item, dropping at a 328 defense. Offering intellect and strength. Okay, so moving on to my Titan, my final character, and from the 30k package, I received the Hair Fury Queen's sniper rifle, dropping at a 329 attack and offering solar burn. Mods were increases the reload speed of this weapon when the magazine is empty, and kills with this weapon reduce the cooldown of your grenade. Not a great roll at all, to be honest. So this poppy will be used for infusion. Moving on, and from the 90k package, I received the Warden's Green and leg armors. Now these dropped at a 330 defense, offering intellect and discipline. Mods were increases the amount of sniper rifle ammunition you can carry and increased agility for 5 seconds after a void double kill. So not bad at all. Now at the moment it is all progress across all three of my characters and I want to get them up to that max light level and until then I won't start and get picky on the things I want. But guys, what light levels are you? Let me know down below in that comment section. And also let me know what you got from the challenge of the elders this week. Thanks for stopping by as always. Do drop a like, I'd appreciate the support. Subscribe for Daily Destiny and I'll catch you guys on that next one. Peace out until next time. Peace! We all on YouTube every damn day. Watching these vids of the brand new games. Bid after bid, many are the same. That's why you gotta go and find DPJ. Destiny gameplays, weekly snipes. Heavy uploads gonna have you a hype. Started in the UK, now he's worldwide. DPJ, go and subscribe.